these bass have a serious problem. You got the grown one. Looks like he has eyeballs. Oh! Look at all these parasites. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, oh my god. What's going on Izzy fam? Welcome back to another video. You guys have been crushing it lately with views, likes, and comments. Huge shout out to you guys. We just hit 80,000 subscribers on the way to 100K and you guys are going to love today's video. Today we're going to be fishing for bass, but not just any bass. These bass have a serious problem. These bass are covered in parasites. So what we're gonna do, we're going to catch the bass, remove all of their parasites, put them in a jar, then we're gonna take it home and find out what exactly it is. We have a tropical storm coming in. It should be around this time tomorrow. The fish should be chewing. With that being said, let's get our lines wet and let's catch some big ones. All right, guys, so we are working our way down to the spot. Bait of choice today is going to be an all white spinner bait that I got on carlsbaitandtackle.com. If you guys want to get some of the best fishing tackle for the lowest price, you can save up to 30% by clicking the link in the description. Use my code, helps me, and it will also help you. But I think we're going to slay some big ones. Let's go. Oh, I just got hit. I just got hit. Come back and get it. Pull the skirt down. Mm -mm -mm. One eternity later. If I get a fish on this cast, I'll reach a million subscribers one day. Ready? <laughs> it's been a oh! you, my friend. <laughs> I just lost one. Oh my god. Did you see did you see that thump, dude? Bro, big thumps. Are they not bass? Are they cichlids? I, I have no idea what's going on right now. There's fish schooled up in this little channel right here. I got hit four times. Don't know why I can't connect with them. But there's tons of fish in here. There it is. That's a, that's a grown one. That's a grown one. Oh my God. Oh, dude. Oh no. I'm falling. That's a grown one right there, dude. Holy smokes. Guys, first one of the day. That's a bucky mouth. As I'm complaining that I can't catch any fish, look at that. He came in and just whomped that spinner bait. That's a good one. I'd say probably closer to four, maybe three and a half. Very, very healthy fish. And guys, this one doesn't have many, but he does have some parasites. So we're gonna go ahead and remove them right now. Guys, this fish has a few parasites on him. I don't know if you can see, but right here is one. I'm gonna go ahead and take it off. Look at that. And that's the parasite right there on my thumb. We're gonna go ahead and put that in the jar. Check it out, that's another parasite right here. We're gonna go ahead and remove him. Got it off in the jar. And he's in. We got two parasites off this fish. It's a little bit weird because we normally find a lot. Guys, first fish of the day, not a bad one at all. Just a fat girl. She's eating good, baby, look at that. Super healthy fish. We're gonna revive her and then send her back on her way. I think she might jump. No, she didn't jump, but she's good. That's what I'm talking about. Yak pack, give me some skin, baby. Nice fish to start off the day. We got two parasites, but I mean, I've literally caught them here and they have close to 30. So we're gonna try to catch as many fish, remove as many parasites as possible. Let's get right back to the fishing. Guys, a little pro tip from a professional bass angler like myself when I cast, I turn my reel sideways usually to prevent backlashes. 60% of the time. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Got him. Ooh. Got him that time. Oh, what is this? That is a good one. Yo, that's a real good one. Oh my gosh. Bro, this is the strongest bass. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Get him up. Back. A giant. That's a giant, dude. That's a giant. No. No. Did I really just catch that, dude? 
<laughs> that's a six pounder. Yeah. That's a six pounder. That's a, that's a good one. Yo. That's a good one. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Oh my God. Look at all these parasites. Boom, 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 boom. Literally everywhere all over this fish. That is a freaking toad. That's an absolute toad, guys. I, I can't believe that. We got to take these parasites off right away. All right, guys, we're going to remove the first. Look at that. One. Oh my gosh. Look at all these ticks all over him. Right here. That one's stuck. There it is. He's in. Look at that. They're crawling all over him. Another one. We locked out on this guy. We're really helping him out. Guys, look at this. You can see really, really clearly this parasite. It looks like he has eyeballs right here. I have no idea what this is. We're gonna take him off. We're gonna put him in our jar. I missed one right here. A big one too. Oh wow. my gosh. Just look at this fish. I mean, straight up donkey. I'm gonna say we probably removed 10 to 12 off this fish. Oh my God, where did he go? He's right here. Wrong way, big girl. See ya, baby. Woohoo! Give me some skin, baby! That's what I'm talking about, Izzy fam. Catching donkeys. You good? Yeah. That's awesome. Guys, we're catching donkeys. Let's keep on fishing. Let's see if we can catch a few more, but we got tons and tons of parasites to examine when we get home. Be sure to stay tuned. Let's catch some more fish. Oh my God. Right there. Oh my God, I just lost one right here. Watch this. I'm gonna be able to catch this fish. Oh my god! <laughs> no. Grab him, grab him, grab him! Stay! Stay! Third fish of the day. Took three tries. Look at this. We got a bunch of parasites on this one. First one. Oh, look at that. That's in. Take this guy off. Oh yeah. Another one. Guys, comment down below if you've ever caught a bass with a bunch of parasites on it. Alright guys, we're gonna go ahead and release this fish. Nice, dude. Let's catch some more. Yeah, abort. Abort. Camera's going in the bag. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh Ooh. my God! Oh my God! Dude, we are smashing them right now. We are smashing these fish. Yeah, we definitely got some leeches on this fish. Let's take them off. All right, guys, we got a bunch of leeches. I know they're hard to see. There's one right here. Got that guy right there, little little one. We only got two parasites off this bass. We're smashing them though. Let's go put them back. We're just gonna throw them over. It's starting to rain. Let's see if we can get some more. All right, buddy. Mwah. See ya. Woo! Get some more. Oh my God, why, why? We spooked him <laughs> and then he came up and slurped it right there. He's got some real good leeches on him too. Oh my God, tons. Look at all these parasites, they're moving. We're gonna go ahead and remove them right now. All right guys, look at that. Juicy one right there. Put that in my hand for now. Oh, we got another one. Look at that, it's a little guy. Check that out. Three, four, six, massive. Oh my God, that's huge. Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right guys, we got 10 parasites off of this bass. Let's go ahead and throw them back. Now let's go add all of these leeches into our container. I'm gonna get them all. Boom, cause they, they stick to each other. Yep. That's 10 leeches right there, guys. We probably have 30 or 40 leeches in here so far. All right, guys, it's getting really windy. It's getting dark. We're gonna go ahead, pack it up. Then we're gonna go to the house, examine these guys, and we're gonna research what the heck they are. I'm excited to find out. If you know, comment in the comment section. With that being said, let's go back home and let's find out together. All right, guys, we are back at my house now, and we did a little research on these guys, and this parasite is actually called water lice. So, Come take a good look at this. As you guys can see, they have that distinct black dot in the middle. We got so many of these guys in all sizes off the fish. Now, does this have a negative impact on the fish? 
yes and no. But for the most part, if you're catching fish in a body of water and they have a lot of these on them, that means that it's a healthy ecosystem. But if you catch a fish with a bunch of water lice on it, that can also mean that it may stress the fish out. As you can see, all the fish that we caught in today's video were extremely healthy, fat, and although that they had this water lice on them, they were still pretty healthy. Let's get 3,000 likes on this video if you guys want a part two. Huge shout out to my buddy Yak Pack Outdoors for holding the camera for me today and helping me out. Be sure to check out his channel, link down below. If you guys are enjoying the content, be sure to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and click that notification bell. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Keep on fishing.